Hello and welcome to How To DNA. One of the most common questions I get asked is how to download your raw data. Once you've received your results, how do you download them for use in, for example, third party programs? At Family Tree DNA, if you want to download your Family Finder results, you can navigate to the Family Finder drop down menu and you'll see the option for download, download raw data. Click on that and it will take you to the next screen where you can download your d raw data and print reports. Now you'll notice there are several different options for downloading your raw data once you've come to this page. You can download your raw data as Build 37 or Build 36 and you can download all of your autosomal data or you can download only your X chromosome raw data. Now the difference between build 37 and build 36 is difference in the version of the DNA of the master DNA. In other words, build 37 is the most recent version of the human genome. Build 36 is the previous version your results will be the same but they will be built or structured slightly different in terms of what version of the human genome they are applied to. If you're interested in simply storing your raw data you can download all of these options and save them in a file on your desktop. Or if you're going to use them for a specific purpose you can download the build that the purpose tells you to use. For example if you're going to use it at a third-party site, that site will usually tell you which build you want to choose. So for example, if the third-party tool says download your Build 37 raw data, you can click here and simply click on that to download your raw data. That will then begin to automatically download and you can save that to a file or folder on your computer.